Okay, it is uh, day 10 of captivity at Happy Tales. <laughs> They've neither killed me or fired me. I've been saying this all day, so. Um, and, and it hasn't prompted them to do anything violent toward me. But anyway, this is a recheck of, uh, I have a rugby scene several times. Uh, we need to uh, spread on some antibiotics for a vaginitis and some ing inguinal areas. We thought she had, she had a pyometra, so this is kind of a recheck. Anyway, it turns out that the large areas of abscessation have actually shrunk down to one small spot. But that one small spot turns out to be a fistula between what looks like the vagina and the outside skin. So what we're going to do is we've uh, gone down the cytology and we're going to go ahead and start on some antifungals because actually in the cytology you can actually see tons and tons of mycelial type yeast. Um, <laughs> like little roots going in and around there. So hopefully this will actually be rather curative. Sometimes you just have to take these things one step at a time. In this case, we basically had to uh, get rid of the bacterial infection um, and uh, basically see the trees from the forest. And so now I've gotten rid of the forest and actually the beginning of the tree that started this whole process or fungus or mushroom anyway. So that's what this case is gonna be like for now. And uh, mom's gonna start her medications as of tonight or tomorrow morning, I'll be up to her. but. Hopefully, by this time next week, we'll have that lump completely gone. What you think? Can we do it? We can do it. <laughs> I'm talking red. I like it. Yay! She's so cute. And she's such a sweetheart. She knows she's trying to help. Her nose. Her nose. Say selfie. Selfie. <laughs> her nose. Okay. I have to go make drugs now. Later. Alright. <coughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Please. Just a little bit. Okay. Alright. And some voices in my head. Okay, cool. I hope that actually hears on this um on this camera. Alright. The crap I put up with. If you'll notice in the background, you can actually see tons and tons of small rods and bacteria, but also notice the long string things that kind of branch. This uh, is the vaginal cytology of a small rat that we thought came in for a pyometra. Um, when it came in for pyometra, we noticed it was tons of inguinal abscesses, it had lots of bacteria. We didn't do a cytology, but it had an obvious bacterial smell. So we went ahead and treated it with some antibiotics. We went for the classic enrofloxacin seems to have brought down the uh, size of those abscesses and left just one left over but it's a uh, a fistula that goes between the vagina itself and the actual uh inguinal area so we squeeze some exudate you're looking at it right there anyway those branching are basically mycelium of some kind of fungal type so we're going to start her on continuer antibiotics because it seems to have helped but we're probably going to go for a stronger fluoroquinolone and now we're actually going to start with uh some antifungals as well. I have not yet decided, but you can see the branching as I'm focusing in and out. That's definitely a sign of fungi. All right, that's it. Later. <laughs>